grew up with horses. Uh, I've had a horse since I was five. It's my passion, I absolutely love it. Now that I've been, developed presbyopia, I have not been able to ride as well because I can't manipulate that near and even that intermediate as well as I used to. I want to be able to go out and win like I used to, and I'm finding it's a very difficult struggle to do that. This whole thing, it's just really hard. It's really hard to grasp because it's just all happening so quickly. I don't want to wear glasses. I don't want to wear readers. I've been in contact lenses my whole life. In my mind, I'm still 25, so I don't want to, you know, have to pull the readers out to read a menu or do anything like that. It's more of a mindset. It bothers me. Yeah, my first memories are probably back in high school. I, I was always involved in sports, and I distinctly remember whenever I would play softball at night, I had great difficulty seeing the ball. That was before a lot of good options were available out there for patients with astigmatism. I feel like I've gotten by my whole life with a prescription that's not exactly correcting what my condition is. And so I just always feel like I am put on the back burner as far as my vision goes. The images close to me are blurry. So it's that it's that multifocal issue that isn't working. The frustrating part is is that you're just not seeing the world from a crisp, clear perspective. I compromise my vision in order to be able to live hassle-free. You know, it's hard when you, you haven't been used to wearing glasses your whole life to remember the glasses and to wear the glasses. I, I get really frustrated when I don't remember them for those hockey games because then I can't see my son on the, the hockey ice in order to make him out and where he is, what, what where's his jersey. So that's frustrating um, for me when I forget them because I, I miss out on seeing what I could see. This lens is not just a new lens or a different lens, it's a, uh, an option that we've not yet had available to us as a ready to deliver option for our patients for immediacy in correcting their vision here in the office. We all in our lifestyles want to be able to have freedom and choices in what we do. And so if I can offer them the exact same options that I offer to my patients without the challenges of an astigmatic presbyopic correction, um, it's wonderful. The Bosch & Lab Ultra Multifocal Forest Astigmatism was an excellent marriage of the stability that I've come to expect with Bosch & Lab lenses. And it not only met my expectations with patients when I was fitting them, it exceeded them in what I found and what patients reported to me with their overall experience. Well, hello, Cindy, how are you? I'm good, how are you, Dr. Wesley? I'm doing fine, I'm excited that you're here today. When you talk to patients about this lens, you can tell them specifically on a scientific level what you're going to expect with your vision because we're correcting astigmatism, we're correcting presbyopia. But honestly, you don't necessarily know what they're going to say or tell you. And when the patients were fit with these lenses, I think they were surprised at how immediate the improvement in their vision was. We focus a lot with multifocal lenses on having clear near vision. We focus a lot with astigmatic lenses, having clear vision at both distance and near. And really the report from patients was, oh my goodness, I can see everywhere so clearly, I think it surpassed what they thought was possibly going to happen. When you're told you're, you have an astigmatism, you know that you have limited options already, so to have this is, is great. I'm most excited about consistency of my vision. To be able to see like I used to, it's just gonna bring back that excitement. I'm so excited to be able to go back to living the way I used to. I am so beyond ecstatic. I know that this is gonna be a breakthrough. I deserve great vision, quite frankly. I just think that 
in today's environment, we should have a lens that helps a patient for this situation. I hear all the time about other patients having great vision. I want that. I haven't ever had it, and I want that. I'm not really sure how I will feel, because I've never had that. And I think it'll be a moment that is like, yes. That's what I'm expecting, is a big boom. Michelle, tell me, how was your experience with the lenses? Oh, Dr. Wesley, it was amazing. It was, as soon as I put the lenses in, I could immediately notice the difference with the intermediate vision. I, one of my biggest fears was that I was gonna feel it on my eye and that it was gonna be uncomfortable. And I'm really amazed that I don't feel it. It's comfortable. Even when I blink, I don't feel anything there. So. Um, I can't believe I was so nervous and it was not a big deal. So I was so happy how quick I adapted to the lenses. You kind of told me that it might take some time, but literally when I left your office, I was seeing so much better. It's going to give me that freedom back. Um, for example, just going out and riding my horse, I'm going to be able to do what I used to do 10 years ago. I just feel like I don't have to worry about, oh my gosh, I can't see this. It just, it's there, you know, and that's what I really like about it. And I'll tell you, the biggest thing that I noticed was on the way here, in my car, being able to read the street signs so clearly, so crisp, looking around and just so surprised how close it was to wearing my glasses. I was just literally gazing out the window at everything across the street, at a distance, and I had a moment. I had a moment of, wow, I feel like I had my glasses on. I truly felt like I had my glasses on. That's how crisp and clear everything was. I don't think I expected that. It, it, the days afterwards, I was just looking for things um, so I could see a little bit crisper, a little bit clearer. Um, and it actually, it, it made me a little emotional, quite frankly.